you see athletes that get large NIL deals. You have, see some with mid size, and by large, I mean you know six figures, multiple six figures. Um, you'll see some that are in the you know a, a middle of the road deal that might be ten thousand dollars or more. Then you have them that are ten thousand dollars or less. Uh, a majority, overwhelming overwhelming majority of the deals are ten thousand dollars or less. Um, because again, it's, it's kind of moved on where businesses want to see an ROI on what they're doing. And so they're evaluating these deals instead of just throwing a ton of cash at it. They're actually looking at players, um, and their ability to market their product more than just, let me just throw a ton of money at it. Um, just to get this athlete to come to our school. Those are, are few and far between the majority of the people that will be listening to this podcast. Um, and you know, I'm sure we'll get to this at some point, but Nothing has changed where you should still go where the coach has the best vision for you over the course of your um, over the course of, of your playing career there. Um, you want to make sure you love the campus, the education, all those different things um, for an overwhelming majority of players. Um, you should still focus on those things other than uh, where can I go that will give me the largest NIL potential. Right. That's valuable. You say that. Right. Right. Fit. 